Oh, hello, I'm Jane Cook. I'm lead stoma care nurse here at Kingsmill Hospital. And I'm Jackie Hatton, one of the stoma nurses here at Kingsmill. Hazel was very bubbly and very lively and very, very helpful. We don't, um, we don't cope very well with IT between the, the two of us, do we? We're not very good on the computer and Hazel bails us out and helps us out with lots and lots of things. Um, she personifies the trust policy of care. She's good with communications. She's respectful to us as specialist nurses and the role that we play within the hospital from the point of view that we do things behind the scenes like um, auditing services etc and she's been more than happy to help do some of the clerical side of that for us mm. um, even though she's got her own workload and busy. One of the things that she did and it was with, with the help of her sister actually was they knew that we had got a deadline to get an amount of envelopes printed to go out to patients and they volunteered just to help us and that saved us such a lot of time and we was able to get the information to the patients at the Within deadline, the deadline. that we, we were working to. Um, so to us that was working beyond her call of what she should be doing. Thank you, we, you do deserve Star of the Month, that's why we've nominated you. You're always there to help us and we're very grateful, thank you. And you do it with a big smile. smile. So I'm Katie Summers and I'm the team leader for the Early Supported Discharge team for Stroke. Well Sue always goes ab above and beyond for all of our patients. Um, she's been working for the team um, since when it developed really in 2009 so her knowledge of stroke is fantastic and she just always puts everything into every visit that she goes in. So we purely do community visits to patients um, and we recently had quite a complex um, patient that needed a lot of rehab. Um, she went in uh, most days to that patient and really you know, worked hard with him and, and really went that extra mile to, to help him with his recovery after his stroke. So quite often our, our patients, uh, with the nature of, um, of their condition are ha having a stroke, they often have communication difficulties. She used her own time to, to put together different resources that she could then use with these patients. And again, that just shows how she's always willing to put in that extra time. Um, she's always willing to, to stay a bit extra if she needs to and, and goes that extra mile. She's an extremely caring person. Um, she's a very supportive colleague. Uh, she's always asking when she can help others um, and she's a joy to, to have in the office. She always asks me if I'm okay and if she can do anything to help and she's very caring with the patients. She never rushes our patients, she always stays however long she needs to and she's got a very good way of explaining why they're doing the rehab to help get them on board with it. Well done Sue, it's a privilege to be your manager, you really deserve this.